We had just busted our butts to almost finish the Elko mural, and then we headed to Salt Lake City to pick up two very special visitors. Now we just had a little bit of mural left to finish before we headed off on our adventures together. And oh, the adventures. Everyone meet Anthony and Francisco, our two nephews that we had not seen in two whole years. They were about to join us on the bus for three weeks of adventure. They flew into Salt Lake City, but would fly home out of Chicago, which meant us four were going to have a true cross-country road trip together. Up to this point, they had both been around Florida, once to the Carolinas, and of course to visit family in Nicaragua. But they hadn't yet been out west to all the places that we were going to visit. So we were so excited for them to get to experience this road trip. Okay, and in the car here, we have Anthony B, the one and only, and Francisco, the true one and only. It's adventure time. As mentioned before, they flew into Salt Lake City. So we didn't want to miss this opportunity to explore the city before heading back to the mural in Elko. We are in Utah, mm -hmm. in Salty City Lake. How's the lake? Close enough? <laughs> there you go. That'll do. We're in Salty Lake City. <laughs> and then we headed back to finish the mural. Jose Luis and Fran, who you'll also hear us call Chico, his nickname, took the reins on completing those last finishing touches on the mural. Meanwhile, Anthony and I were busy exploring the geology of Northern Nevada. Are you focused? Right here. There it is. That's the Maybe this from, this was, from a, a beach. Cool. Is this a fossil that you got on? Yeah, it's got a fossil in it. Mm. You gotta look at it under the loop. And you, you can find it. Just be patient. Show me. Holy cow. Can I take all, can I take all of these? All of them? Yeah. We'll narrow them down. Look at you go. Glide. Good, maintain that balance. You got it. Whoop. Hey. All right, we just finished our biggest mural yet. We budgeted three weeks for it, uh, and which is today is three weeks. It just took a lot more time than we expected to, to put on, on, on the mural. Initially, we thought that it was going to take only 40 hours a week for me and 20 hours a week for Cora, and we went way over that. But I'm happy that we finished it, and in the three weeks that we budgeted for it, we busted our butts, working really hard. The volunteers helped a lot. But it's finished. It's finished, Anthony. The final panels weren't yet installed, but later on, Matt sent us pictures of both walls in their final revitalized form. This is a Sunday meal could you that we eat in Nicaragua and it's called La Catamal. Now before we left Elko, we wanted the boys to experience a little more of what the area has to offer. First things first, we went to go see all the murals. You may be wondering, 
Is it common for towns in the U.S. to have so many murals? Nope, Elko is just awesome. In 2019, they hosted the Elko Mural Expo, in which 43 artists came from across the world to paint a whopping 51 public murals. Incredible. Then we took the boys to go see the balloons. And then the three boys went on their own little guy adventure to Lamoille Canyon, while I stayed behind and edited that Wanderer music video. So what do you think of me? I think that's pretty, pretty pretty. Very pretty? Yeah, very pretty. We're going to the lake and we're going hiking. Are you excited? Yup. We are on our way to do a little hike uh, to Lemoyne Lake. It's gonna be almost 10,000 feet of elevation. It's gonna be a, like a 3.7 mile hike. And uh, we're really excited about it. You ready for the hike? Yep. Do one with that with, with less zoom. Okay. Mm -hmm. What you doing? <laughs> oh, I see it, I see Yeah, it's on. Went up. Oh, look, he's on the top of the tip. Oh my god, that's so cute. It looks like a squirrel. Where are we going, guys? To ice. A mini glacier. Almost there. Touch. Whoa. No way. That is the most gorgeous thing ever. I just wanted to do one. Oh, I made a snowball. What is that? Snow nugget? <laughs> Good one, Anthony. Oh shoot. You're a funny guy, huh? <laughs> You're a funny guy, huh? <laughs> Alright guys, time to go back to the bus. And then it was time to hit the road. It's done. So we finished the igloo mural. This is definitely our biggest mural to date. We don't know if anything was gonna be able to beat this one, but we're excited it's done because we have two very special VIPs on the bus with us. That's right. That we're really excited to go on some adventures with now. Yeah, so now we have two weeks to drive across country all the way to Chicago. Yeah, so we are on to our next adventures. Are you guys excited? Woohoo! Where are we heading today? Do you remember? Yeah. Great Basin National Park. If we can get there. All right. Where's that, at? that direction, right? Uh, yeah. No. That direction. That, that, direction. that direction? That direction. We're going to get lost. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. Woo! Yeah.
Bye, I love you, Igloo. Bye, I love you. Our actual first stop ended up being Metropolis Ghost Town. We couldn't miss showing the boys a real ghost town. Of course, we took the easy way this time. Coyotes and wolves, where we're gonna die. <laughs> we're gonna die. Can you hear the coyotes and the wolves? Huh? We're going under. You can go under to, to, that, to, the, to the bottom step. That's it. No more. Because, yeah, when it gets wet, things get heavier. Right there, right there. That's it. Come back. Ooh. It's too dangerous. You see? This, uh, all this rubble on top is very wet right now. So that adds like tons and tons of weight. It's another, uh, like a plank. A slab. Slab. So there's probably another house here, over here, or something else. And if you walk all around here, you'll find more of this. You'll find a lot of these slabs everywhere. And then we were off again. This is when we felt like our adventure was really starting. We were off to our first national park, which was also a first for me and Jose Luis as well. Our destination, Great Basin National Park. Whoa, look how tall that mountain is, Anthony. You see it to the right? Look, the mountain is in the clouds. That is the tallest mountain in the whole world. Look, we're in the desert again. The trees. Wow, look at the wind turbine. Wow. Do you remember what's the name of this state? Uh, Nevada? Whoa. We got a new driver here, Hi. driving higher elevations for the first time. Nervous, chica? Maybe just a little. And we got two little punks over here reading a book. Dog man. He looks even more ridiculous than usual. Yeah. About that. Where? Right there. What? About that. Right there. Right there. Oh my gosh, you ass. I was like, yes, we get to see it. It's a bad cat, see? Are you cursing, Tia? I'm sorry, but that was mean. Well, we only gained 600 in elevation. That's easy. Easy peasy. What can I be using? Oops, I'm going to break the record for Gookiest Hat for for that too, <laughs> but the main record is going to be Skipping Rock. 
Here it goes. That one did a low skip. You see what it did? What about troll? That's so tall. Yeah, that's the tallest Christmas tree. <laughs> yeah. Imagine you just balance with one foot on the tippity top. Yeah, look and at that rock. And I found a piece of cord. You want to test it? See what hardness it is? Ooh, yeah. Piece of cord. yeah, another piece of quartz. You can't scratch it. Ah, so it's probably quartz as well, don't you think? It's either quartz or something stronger than quartz. See that, that line up there? What one? Where the trees stop? That's called the tree line. Any guesses why there aren't trees up there? I know. Why? There's, there's, too, there's not enough air. Oh, that's a that's a really really good point. That might have something to do with it. And there's not that much rain. Yeah, that might be another reason. Wow. Look at that! Look at the ants carrying like devils. Wow, those stones. Oh my. This tree has seen. 4,000 years. 4,000 years? Yep. Onwards. Hey, look, I found this purple rock. Oh, I'm going to put it in the rock collection. collection. Okay. Okay. All right. This is my new, uh, what's it called again? Uh, what's it called again? Hmm? Galaxy God Rock. Yes! <laughs> galaxy God Rock. That's me. All the rocks that I found like Galaxy, I call them that. Galaxy God Rock. We are? And, uh, uh. What's the name of the park? Uh. Great. Great National Park. Great Bay. Great Base National Park. Basin. Basin National, National park. park. And right now. We are hiking. We are hiking and looking at. These so, amazing trees, there are, looking, some of them are as old as 5,000 years old. And we're looking for trees that are much older than the other trees that are in Florida. Exactly. So you can see black ants here. What are they carrying? They're carrying their eggs. See this? Almost just a, like dragon face right there. Guys, these are really smooth. Beautiful. This is an ancient, ancient, ancient tree. No way. Like, why? Why, why, why? Busto. Look up. Chico, you want to tell us what's up there? It's a glacier. It's a glacier. It's a beautiful glacier. <laughs> and what's a glacier, Ron? It's like a river, but with ice. Yeah. It moves very slowly. Wait, whose turn is it? Go on, Anthony. I'm so close to the pots! No, you're close. Five, one, two, three, four, five. Oh. Take a chance. You're killing it, Chico. Let's go get a trophy card. Oh, man. Right. Hey, it's Haley. Look at the eyes. You catch any, Anthony? I eat it. I eat it. Nope. Okay. <laughs> I've got some. I got one. Oh, three. look at it. Ah. Oh. Well, our time in Nevada had been awesome. We all felt we had already seen and lived so much, but the fun was really just getting started. Experiences like these with the ones you love 
are really what life is all about. And when you have the opportunity to make these experiences happen, you take them. Next time on Aren't We There Yet? Next stop for these four travelers? Well, we were now excited and ready to visit the great state of Utah. Hey guys, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to give us a like. Subscribe to our channel. Send us a comment below. And for exclusive content and a behind the scenes view of the Art Be There Yet journey, join us on Patreon. See you over on Patreon.